Hello and welcome back to Brimple Plays Blackthorn Arena. This is Chapter 6, Episode 5. We are 20 days away from the spring game, so that's what we're training for. We have a lot of people who are um, currently defenders and getting enough endurance to get the revive skill. We do have people who need to become Ronin still to shoot uh, Shuriken, including Dina. Dina's level 12, so it won't take her long. Uh, or, I mean, she won't have to catch up. But we got to start the training right now. 12 days is... Or 20 days is not far out. It'll go by very quickly. Bunch of... Hmm. It says they're average level 11, but it doesn't appear that way. Here's something that appears more our level, our speed. Wondering if we can actually manage this with this team. Aiken, what can you do now? Well, as long as Aiken isn't a rogue, he's not, or a Ronin, he's not going to do huge damage. So I don't want him coming out on the trip. Rosanna, what are you? You're a duelist marksman. You need training, like, badly as well. Uh, Elmer, you need to heal. Although, obviously, I want you to come out on the mission. Uh, I think just sending these four people out, they ought to be able to win the mission anyway, so let's do it. It's risky, especially if Elmer were to go down, she could easily die. Now a shield maiden on their team, you know, she could be difficult to take down. The rest of their team, like her and her, her and him, ought to go down pretty quickly if they get focused on. But if everyone goes for the shield maiden, that could be bad for us. We're lucky we have, um... Oh my goodness, Steve. Are you kidding me? Unreal. It's just unreal how much... Uh, damage the team can do before they even get over here. And then the smoke pill for defensive purposes. Fantastic. That's crazy. I, I didn't want to... I... It's just so almost impossible to believe how overwhelmingly powerful this team is. Ripping through enemy teams like it's nothing. You need to continue researching. You've only researched two things so far? That's not good. It's my fault, but... You know, couldn't you do something out of your own volition? Just saying. It's going to take me a while to complete that training yet. 18 silver to beat a level 5. Look, I don't need to beat a level 5. But it just seems like that's a lot of money to beat a level 5. Maybe not. This is what I was looking for. You know, they have the Chevalier. Monster Butcher Boots for beating you? Okay, we have to, we have to let Elmer heal at least one turn. Rosanna, you gotta quit healing. You gotta... Go train. Poor Elmer. But we do want to challenge your level 11s. Just making sure there was nothing better for us really quick. Now let's go. Yep, looks like the right team. You can't go, you're in genre training. Clayton, I feel like you leveled up again. It sure looks like it. 
He's been acting like a main character on the team for quite a while. He's certainly been doing his part. He's soon to become a defender. Guess he ought to get some endurance. Lad ought to train as well. Probably by getting his heal leveled up. It's going to be a while before he can get unyielding. Oh my gosh. His endurance is so low. It's just crazy how low it is. I can't believe they're giving away monster butcher boots if you win this fight. They must be geared very, very well. This must be a very tough fight. I see some uh, veteran, right? Heavy veteran, I think. She's wearing heavy veteran. This, this, it, this could be very tough. That's all I'm saying. We hate to see somebody on our team taking damage like that from the archer. Oh, she changed targets. Thank goodness. All right, Marriott missed blocker. It's now four, four v one. Oh, it's not. Mariana is still up. Can you? No, she's gonna kill Elmer. No. Oh, but Elmer's gonna get back up because she has that trait. Yes. Good job, Elmer. That's incredible. Well, that was a very tough fight. That's why we got such a great reward for it and great experience. If I can keep this team alive, and that's a big if, they will be so powerful at the spring games. Time for you to wear. Well, is it time for you to wear? I got a lot of people wearing not the best gear. I guess you can wear that. The Monster Butcher boots are so crazy. You can wear them. I guess we'll get rid of these light gauntlets and we'll just send a servant to the store to do that. Elmer. Yikes. You can chill out, Elmer, while everybody else goes to do something. I don't even really know what I'm looking for other than blue items when I come here. Like a, well, like what I just got. Veteran heavy armor. I, I'd look for a blue bow, but the only bow I can think of that would be worth it is, is it the steel bow? That's blue, has precision, and I think crit rate. And a high attack speed. That's what makes it worth getting. Is it's high attack speed. If I'm thinking of the correct one. Don't really like what I saw at this merchant. So we'll just move on. Jason. Time for you to get your fourth piece. Of veteran gear. We'll give your heavy chest. To lad. Tr 
for training. Oh man, you are still training. Gosh. We could go earn 36 silver. Again, I don't know. If it's not a blue caravan or a blue chest, it feels kind of pointless right now. Because we are doing well with regard to our money and to our experience. Our experience. Level 18s? I don't... We're tough. I don't think we're level 18 tough. You know, punch above our weight by five levels tough. No way. It is nice to see Elmer uh, <clears throat> kicking butt and back in action, though. I'll tell you that. Clayton, is it time for you to finally become a defender? Or did anyone else on our team? I don't think anyone else on our first string needed training. Aiken needs to become a rogue for sure. Clayton, you will become a defender. After you become a defender, Aiken can become a rogue. Yeah, we'll have just enough time for that too, that's fine. Do we need that? What if we just made Aiken a rogue and a ronin? And that, that way we have a guy with two of our needed backup traits. I think that's the better path. Then we continue to train you. I'm okay having two backups going into the spring games. Who need to learn how to be a defender still. Oops, I didn't want to look at inventory. I wanted to look at arenas. Ten, huh? Oh, yeah, but we're forbidden from entering a lot of that stuff. It's messed up. That's why we were looking at the map. <laughs> After the spring games, we won't have that problem. Chameleon for 105 influence? I mean, yeah. Absolutely. Should be easy money for these three. And again, easy influence, huge influence to 105. Chameleons give you just an absurd amount of influence relative to their difficulty, in my opinion. Maybe they're really tough if you don't burst them down the way that my team has been able to, but I don't know, I find them to be super weak. Easy money. Easy influence. I was just Tolerate people, whether or not they're breaking up or getting to together. Whatever they're doing, I'm tolerating. I don't, I don't care. Do what you want. Just don't tell me about it. I don't need to know everything. I don't know why you guys think I do. They're like, we need to tell you. You're the master of the arena. You need to know this. I don't. I don't. Have some discretion, you know. We continue to just level up, I guess, to train while we look for chests and caravans. We have good money, so we have no reason to take really dumb stuff that won't give us good experience. We should try to stay on top of uh, obedience a little bit better. Good thing you finished training as a Ronin, now you can train as a Rogue. And the rest of the team will continue to look for something to do. 
I don't even want to fight animals right now. I'm not so interested in the favor. And it looks like I've taken on the arenas that I can take on for right now. Everybody else is like level 16, level 13. Oh, these guys are level 11s. Okay. There you have it. We'll, we'll fight these guys. Lad, Jason, Elmer, and Clayton. No, 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 no. Dina. It's great to see that Clayton is considered so powerful that they're putting him out there. Ahead of Dina, though. She's got a good heal. She needs to level up from this fight, though, and get uh, Shuriken. I didn't realize Elmer leveled up. What would I put your points into right now? I think it's just taking less damage. And then investing into ranged. Probably should have invested in into ranged, but whatever. All of my people. This guy's level 15. We've really climbed up the ranks, and he can finally learn Unyielding. Gosh, we've been working towards that forever. He can get his crit. Everything has worked out. May as well invest a, another point into ranged. Just one, though. That's all we can do. Max out crit. I guess that's it. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's fine for now. Jason is really powerful. He'll become a berserker soon. Lad is so far behind on his endurance. Poor guy. What can you do, though? He's got Smoke Pill, which is good enough. It's nice to have a, at least a couple of people with Unyielding at this point, though. Something that just makes them... Unreal in terms of taking them down. You know, you run over there, you try to attack more people. You get hit with the smoke pill. Like, oh, okay. You go back, you actually kill them. Or so you think. Guess what? They get back up. You run over to attack them. Oh, they smoke pill you again. What a nightmare. And just wait. They're going to become berserkers. They're going to be even more difficult to kill. <laughs> oh my gosh. I didn't even see everybody go down in that fight. That was funny. Look at you, you did zero damage. You took 252, so you you obviously just went down instantly. Elmer was an absolute machine gun, apparently. It's crazy. I love it. And we've got six days until the spring game still. We could fight a level 13 for 42 silver. We could fight you for a battle stick. And you know what? I feel like our archers could take them on, honestly. I don't know that it's worth it, though. We, we may even be able to take on these level 13 teams that we're seeing. A Warmaster, Gatebreaker... I don't know what Duffy and whoever, I don't know what they do. Does it matter? Do I take them on? Why not? We're interested in the experience. We have two alternates that are decent level, if things really look grim. 
And I guess we could always just give up if things looked really, really bad. You know, we could yield if need be. Although I should try to keep a running stock of who's got the defender trait to come back up and who doesn't. Ooh, I don't like that gatebreaker guy getting close to me with that big two-handed weapon. They're a pretty tanky team, but it didn't matter once they got close. Once they got close to me, it was all over. Plus, I have multiple people who can heal. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was incredible. See, what I really appreciate about that is it's really great experience. You just get a lot of experience points go into that doing that now these people are level 13 as well so we will challenge them and get experience for fighting them hopefully hopefully we win you know again things could go very haywire and again I did not check to see who has that defender trait Ooh, two senior medium tier twos. You're dangerous. So are you. You two could really hit hard. I'm not worried about the other two, but I am worried about you two with the two-handed weapons. Especially if you use kick or something to knock me down immediately. Oh, you got smoke pilled. Nothing good happens for you once you get smoke pilled, so. Look at that. Their team got mowed down. Amazing. It's just incredible. We are going to be going into the spring games with just a, an absurdly powerful team. There is no other way to put it. This is ridiculous. I thought for Ronin was a ridiculous but you know powerful build. This is insane. Four archers. Four archers with a specific build, I, I think. You know, I think that helps. That I don't marksman stats and nothing else but um still they're killing everything within seconds usually and they have high defenses after this fight we will allow them to rest until the spring games that way they have full health. Aikman will be finished training um, right before the spring games, one day before then. And we will have two alternates who are high damage, just low defenses. So stupid. Lad did really high damage. Good for him. And you notice everybody is still using just a, like a white bow. In term, well, you've got a long bow actually. You've got a long bow. You've got a recurve bow, so two people on our first string. The two people doing the most damage by far have the fastest weapons. The recurve bow. What does that tell you? Three days out? I'm not going to. 
go do another mission. You learned rogue really quickly. I guess you can go train. And you can go in treatment. And we will wait one turn, and everyone will go back to training. Rosanna, you are nowhere near ready to do anything. You need to go become a rogue, a ronin, and a defender as well. For now, let us spend everybody's skill points from leveling up. Just working for more endurance, what can I say? Gosh, we need two more levels to get unyielding. So at level 16, we will finally have it goodness. What can we do to increase our lifespan ahead of then? I think we'll just hold on to the skill points. For Jason, anything you can do? You've not leveled up yet again. Which is unfortunate. We I guess we didn't put ourselves in a position to find more experience potions for you, but we were getting crazy experience anyways, as you can tell by your level. You're ready to continue dumping points into your ranged abilities, including quick aim. I've been thinking I want everyone to get quick aim so they can shoot really quickly. That's it. Max out your heal. Make sure you take less damage. What, what, what did you need intelligence? Oh my gosh. You learned Ronin and I haven't even given you the skills. How embarrassing. Oh well. You will get enough experience to learn Ronin skills from the spring games. going to go to the spring games now so actually we're going to end this episode and we will go to the spring games to begin the next episode so thank you for sticking around and i'll see you next time